Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling an important question from a developer who's integrating Facebook authentication into their application. They want to know about potential security issues when using the Facebook JavaScript SDK. Let's dive in. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you work through to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. Let's start by understanding the Facebook JavaScript SDK and its implications for security. The SDK allows you to easily integrate Facebook authentication into your application. You mentioned using a server-side approach to handle access tokens, which is a good practice. This keeps sensitive information away from the client. However, using the SDK introduces new considerations. The concern arises when you allow the client to handle access tokens. If a hacker injects malicious JavaScript into your web page, they could potentially access the token using the getLoginStatus method. To mitigate these risks, ensure that you implement content security policy headers and validate all inputs. Additionally, consider using short-lived access tokens and refreshing them securely. Lastly, remember to keep your app secret secure. This should never be exposed to the client side as it is crucial for maintaining the integrity of your application. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To access your Facebook access token, ensure you have a valid redirect URI that matches your site URL in your Facebook app settings. Additionally, you need the appropriate permissions to post using the access token. You can check your API calls using the Facebook API Explorer tool. And that's it guys. We've gone through the solutions and I'm hoping that it resolved your issue. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.